Jordan song. Hey guys, six o'clock on Monday. I know I wasn't here on Sunday, but if you catch me today after tag me with hashtag replay, please. This is Jojo with Jojo's Rustic Remnants. We are here in the living room with Nana over there and the two pups. Gia's right here. Oh my goodness. Oh, she has a big full belly. She just had some prime rib. Look at big old full belly. She had her regular dinner, but you know, Nana gave her a little prime rib. We have to whisper because we can't tell Luciano that. Let's see if I can find the live. Willie's here. Me and Willie is here. Hey, Will. What's up? Let me see if I can find my own live. Oh, here we go. Uh, okay. Da, da, da. Turn the sound off, Joanne. And let's see if I can get to... If I can get to the comments, how's everybody doing? I hope you had a good Sunday yesterday. I was a busy bee all weekend and I needed a break. And today <clears throat> was a day off for me. So say bye-bye. Bye-bye. Oh, you got, look at this big fat belly. It's so full. She's so heavy. Hang on. Let me give her to Nana before we get started. You guys, we're going to be doing two colors which generally I don't put together, but we're doing it. Why can't I open up my own live? Gosh, good golly. It's always a struggle, always a struggle. How's everybody? Hey, Pam. Hi, Leanne. Hi, Kathy Gaffney. How's everybody? All right, so let me see if I can get the live while we wait for some folks to come on. And let's see, Facebook. Let's go here. Okay. Uh, I'm very, very excited because I'm headed to Louisiana to go see Damon and Parker and some folks from the CMC group. And I'm going to be able to see the warehouse. I'm so excited. <laughs> Although I'm probably going to be sweating my britches off because... It's Louisiana, and it was 70 today. I'm in my short britches and a t-shirt, and, um, you know, it's gorgeous out. It's gorgeous. Today was a JoJo Bigelow kind of a day. All right, so Betty's with us, and Tanya, and Tracy. Hi, hi. Okay, so, again. Oh, I can't see everybody. Well, let me look up there. Let me see if I can make this bigger. I can make it a little bit bigger so I can read it Love up on the, the screen. Love the color of your nails. Thank you. I just got that. This is very wild for me. I'm typically a French. What is the CMC group? It's one of Damon's um, coaching groups. And um, if you go on there, you can look it up. It's pre any of the stuff for Mastermind. I'm so not ready for that. I'm barely ready for what I'm doing right now. But it is what it is. All right. So, guys, this is what I picked for my ribbons. Pretty, pretty. And I may end up doing my bow first. In fact, let's let's do that first. We're going to open up a new one. Actually, I have two two wreaths I made today I want to show you. One is pink and purple. I'm all into the purple. I, I never like purple. Like, I'm a blue girl. I made a watermelon today. It's super cute. It's little. Let me show you. So... I had one of these, what do you call this, willow wreaths left. Can you guys see that? And I got this, which from is from Deco Exchange. It's one of their signs, but it's the wreath size. And, oh, can you see it? It's hard to see. I just think it's so cute with that watermelon hanging off the side. Lots of fanny panty ribbon, but, and I have all the pinks. And that watermelon, I think, is so cute. Anyway, it had all the greens, so I got very excited to use my last willow wreath. So I made that today to bring down because I actually had a pretty good week in the shop. 
I was excited about that because I haven't really sold anything online or in the shop. And this week, I had a good week, sold three. So that's a big deal for me. Anyway, in the shop, I was super excited. So I made that one. Then I made another one that I'm going to, that's posted and putting in the shop. And then I decided to do this one. Okay. Because I had to fill some holes. You know, when you get a hole in the shop, you got to fill it. Show them the one you made, Auntie Judy. Oh, you'll miss, um, so my Aunt Judy, that's in the nursing home. I made her, I can't get it, Ma, you'll have to get it because I got the wire over here. All right, so I'm actually going to go with this 7 8 in the back of my bow. Let's cut this part off. My Aunt Judy is in a nursing home and we wanted something for her door. Is it a nursing home, Ma? She's in an assisted, assisted living. Assisted living. She has Alzheimer's and it's very sad and... We just like to send her pretty things. And my mom likes to send her snow globes because they light up and they play music. And, you know, some, she doesn't always open her eyes anymore. But, you know, it's as much for the people like my Uncle Gene that go and visit her, my cousins, as it is for the nursing and the people that take care of her. And my mom always sends them our chocolates and cookies down there. Oh, here it is. So this is one of the other signs. And I just absolutely love this sign. I don't know if you can see. It has the beautiful mason jar here that I love. And then I just put in some daisies and lemons to go with it for her front door, her bedroom. I just love this sign. It's such a beautiful sign. Thanks, Mom. I love the daisies. I love the lemons. Yeah. Um, so we're going to wrap that up and ship it to my Uncle Gene, and he will bring it to her. Okay, so we've got that. Now I'm going to go in with the darker purple fancy panty. And I was going to do a velvet, but I decided against it. Not for any particular reason, but I just did. All right. Luciana, what are you doing over there? Uh, watch her because she's kind of on the screen and I don't want her licking anybody's business while we're on the computer. We'll get kicked off. Gia. I made that a little my bit too. My in a nursing home breaks my heart. Yeah, it's very, very sad. Both my Aunt Judy's have Alzheimer's and it's very, very hard. Um, all right, so I did two of that. Let's do two of this one too. We might as well. Might as well make a big old bow, you know. These two wreaths definitely give me Mother's Day vibes. All right. Then I'm going in with this yellow. Now, this is more of a bee yellow than a lemon yellow because I'm going to be using these ranunculus, which are definitely a more yellow yellow than a, and this one, which I think is a poppy. So it's a darker yellow and not the traditional like lemon yellow, if that makes any sense. All right. Uh, you guys can see what I'm doing, right? I think I'm just going to do, am I going to do one of that? No, I'm not. I'm going to do two. With those are in my dad had it and we still miss him so much. Yeah. They're just... You know, you need a big old Bigelow bow. I'm doing a big old Bigelow bow. And then I'm going to put this pretty um, braided one that I just love. Love it, love it, love it. I've used it a couple times today. But I have to remember to roll, roll the edge because I don't like to leave it undone. So this one we're going to do. One, two, a third, and I'm going to loop it under my thumb and twist it and let it hang down. Okay. Then I was just playing with, oh, here it is. I got it. I was just playing with a zip tie. And I'm going to go in there. I noticed that. I'm getting a little bit more and more arthritis in the hands because my fingers don't hold things like they used to. Like I can't pinch it as tight, but that's all right. That's what zip ties are for. And then if 
I struggle with it. I just don't, I don't pinch it all the way. I just literally bend it and fold it and bend it and fold it to get a few more clicks in, then put it off. All right, so how am I gonna figure this out? I'm gonna pull these down, all these pretty babies, and spread out all the loops. Is anybody else doing stuff for Mother's Day, getting little shops and areas ready? Or are you just doing it on Etsy? We typically have a, you know, a decent crowd for Mother's Day. People like to come there for lunch. So, all right, I don't want one of these loops to come over here. Okay. Okay, so I did not use any two and a half. So... I'm going to go way to the top. Not quite like 1130. I'm going to go, you know, my favorite place. And um, it's nice that people will come in. And I wonder if Don's going to do a buffet, like a Mother's Day buffet. Because it's on a Sunday this year. And typically, I know, but I wonder if she'll open for Mother's Day. Or maybe she's going to take the off. day off because she's a mom. <laughs> All right. Let me get this zip tie in here. And we're going to cinch that sucker as tight as possible. Okay. Mm. Whoops. What did I do? Anna Simmons oh. is recovering from pneumonia. What oh, my gosh. Take care of yourself. Where did you get your reed stand? Um, from Stencil It Up. It's um, a combination of Scott and Angie and I think you order them on stencil it up all right so let's bring this polka dot down all right I love my long tails because I love to hump the hump so we're gonna do a little bit of that pretty but this is what I'm gonna do here I'm gonna cut this off give a nice sharp cut and I'm gonna fold it and I'm gonna fold it again I don't like that to come undone and fold it again all right and a little center we go there and then we're gonna cut all the short <coughs> ones we're gonna dovetail those okay and I'm going to do the same thing at the bottom of this one. I'm going to cut it nice and straight. Give it a clean cut. Fold it and roll it. Just like you were rolling any other like double-sided ribbon or anything like that. And I'm going to leave these long for a minute. I'm going to see how much this would hold as a curl. I'm not sure how strong this one is. Oh, not too bad. These, I think, I'm going to loop. Why are you huffing, Mom? I don't know. It keeps shutting off on me. Well, that's Facebook. What are you going to do? What you going to do? We're going to green up our base with some beautiful greenery that has purple tips. But first, I'm going to take some a little zip ties, and I'm going to get these little things a-going. I'm going to leave this one loose for now. I have a perfect crossbar right here. So don't worry, we're going to fill these little things in. You're not going to even see them. Not even a little bit. Yeah. No CT. I don't know. CT? Oh my God, I forgot to call you back the other day. I was having lunch with mom when you called. I'm so sorry, I forgot to call you back. Hi, Margie. I know they are, but um, I'm, Dawn does never gouges anybody for anything. She just doesn't do that. Her food is spectacular. She probably will stay closed because she's a mom, so, and she stays closed on Monday, so, I mean on Sundays. Easter, Mother Day, Mother I just Day. read that. More expensive, like $50 a person, yeah. Oh, they're way more than $50. It's okay, I'll talk to you later. Oh, I'm so sorry, CT. It just, when I, my mom said your name, I realized that <clears throat> you called. All right, so we're going to dovetail this and leave it long. 
I'm going to clip this one, leave that one a different, and then this dark purple one I'm going to bring down Has he here. Heard from Yvonne? What's that? Has he heard from Yvonne? Have you heard from Yvonne, uh, CT? I sent you a message, but she didn't reply. Um, we exchanged a couple of little texts here and there. All right, let's get a little bit of... All right. There we go. Brushes and boards. Hi, Ange. I was just talking about you. Would you put your link in for this wreath stand? Could you do that? Now, this little piece of fancy panty ribbon needs a little steaming because see how it folded over? So I'm going to cut this one short. And we're going to give that a little curl. Okay. And we'll play with those later. So now... We're doing purple and orange. Can you believe that? Not a pair I would typically do. I but I'm trying to mix up my colors. Yeah, I don't know. She didn't answer my last message. She might not have seen it, Mom. Oh, she did see it. She okay, was... Elaine. Well, maybe she was tired. She's very, very tired. I do know that. So I'm going to be... Look at these. Aren't these beautiful? The green yeah, and purple. You she look said this. she doesn't know how to put her link in. Oh, stop it. You're hilarious. Call Scott and tell him to do it. People were asking about um, this wreath stand. All right. So I'm dipping and sticking. And I'm greening up my... Oh my gosh. This greenery right here is so awesome. It is a eucalyptus purple tips. I should say that a little bit clearer. Tips. Tracy must, Bradley must be asking what's wrong with Yvonne, but she's... Oh, she's, Yvonne um, had surgery quite a while ago, and she's going to have to have another one. She, quite frankly, almost died. She scared all of us to death, and she's having to recover, and it's exhausting, and she's tired all the time. and yellow on Facebook. What looks yellow? The ribbon. It is. This is yellow. Or the tips look yellow. This is green, dark He's green. The ribbon. the ribbon is yellow. Debbie Bennett. The ribbon is yellow for sure. All right. So I it's yellow and purple. Gonna be greening up this base. And I've got a couple of different greeneries we're gonna use. And then I'm gonna be pulling out some beautiful dark purple peonies and some beautiful yellow floral I'm trying to you change said it, it with colors. orange no i said it's more orange than yellow um because it's not lemon yellow it's it has like an undertone of orange in it a little red undertone i would say i'll show you what i mean so this this is a lemon yellow. Can you see the difference? This is lemony, which wouldn't go with the floral that I picked. Um, so it's it's a shade like more mustardy than this one, which is lemon yellow. All right. So up in this bow, I'm definitely going to poof it out with all of these greens. Keep it sitting nice and high and pretty. This is a pusher, this particular Adrian. eucalyptus. Hey, Adrienne, how are you? Happy Monday. You know why it's a happy Monday? I'm not in the office. <laughs> Although I do have a big event on Wednesday. I will not be live Wednesday unless I like go live from the hotel or something because I leave Wednesday afternoon for Louisiana. For literally a couple days. I come, I come back Saturday night. Um, it was literally a last minute decision. Joyce from Pennsylvania. Hey Joyce, how are you? I had a, um, oh, I forgot to take this off. The zip tie. I, I was supposed to design on stage in Louisiana um, for general wholesale and that got canceled. So... When that happened, I sort of lost that little vacation I was planning to have. Yeah, right over there, Elaine? Yeah. And um, I was really upset about it because I really needed to get, get away. Did you get a boss ribbon from Damon? Uh, yeah, I have like 50 rolls. Let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14.
I have like 30 rolls. Like a little carried away, but I wanted all the colors, as many as I could get, and I wanted different sizes of the colors. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Yes, and I love it. It's so economical, but it holds so nicely. It really does. All right. Get on up in there. I want to have some floral coming down in the center here as well. Alicia posted it. Thank you, Alicia. So anyway, very last minute, decided it was I could go, and I'm just doing it. Because what are they going to put on my tombstone? She never took vacation. You know, I'm going. It's probably the worst time of year for me to go, but it is what it is. I'm living my life. I'm living my best life. Doing the best I can. Right, Nana? Yeah. So, my, uh, Wednesday morning... You're jealous because I went away. I'm going away again. No, I'm not jealous because You're you went jealous because I went away. No, I was disappointed that I couldn't do the vacation I was planning. Yeah. And I needed a break back then, which would have been two weeks ago I would have been there, I think. So, when that Sharon, fell through... Hey, Sharon. When that fell through, I was like, screw it. I'm going on my vacation. Sharon said, yes, live your life. Yeah. These people don't care about me anyway at work, so listen, I'm just going to do my thing. You come out here, you know, so I'll go to work. I'll do my event on Wednesday morning, and then I'm gone for two and a half days away from the office. I said, don't call me. Well, you can call me, but I'm not going to answer. <laughs> but we did, uh, Ryan and I just hired another young lady. Um who's going to start after Memorial Day. So that is super exciting. So we will have help for the summer. Well, we'll have help, full-time help. And um, she'll be helping Ryan with summer conferencing while I'm probably loading the new software and all that kind of stuff. There's so much going on. It's just absolutely crazy right now. Okay, so I have... Where are you going? I'm going to Deco Exchange to go see. All right, I want to use these four things. No, nope, I want to use this first. I want to use these first, I think. Because I want these to, one to go up high and one to go down low. And they have yellow, <coughs> the darker yellow, and greenery. These are Regency. And let's cut this down here. We don't need that stick, so. Um, I love, they, they package up all these butterflies, so you got to take them out carefully. Oh, Lord, Gia is snoring. So I'm very excited to see the warehouse. That will be fun. I'm excited to meet new people that I have no idea who they are. Huh. They're all different um, businesses. So that will be exciting to meet some new people. All right, how am I going to get this off here? We're going to cut it without cutting the wire, hopefully. Oh, she's got a full belly. She's snoring so loud. How much beef did you give that little girl? I just gave her a few little pieces. Just a few little pieces. Nana says, she's back. Can I give her some beef? <laughs> These rib she, had tonight. she had prime rim. Poor Luciano didn't get any. He can't have that stuff. It's too rich for his blood. He does not do that. Gia the street dog. She could eat anything. <laughs> Alright, these are cool for a couple of reasons. They are water resistant. They're plastic. But they have like a canvasy um, thing on there. So, we're going to put the... Oh, Lord, i got to take the one, this one off too. Probably should have done this ahead of time, huh? There's another one too. No, two butterflies. Maybe that's the one. Okay, here we go. So these little orangey yellow guys. You can come visit me in Abbeville, Louisiana. Where's that? In three hours east of Chef. Three hours, girl. I'm I'm gonna be there for two and a half days. I literally get there Wednesday night. I have class on Thursday and Friday. 
Saturday morning and I get back on a plane late in the afternoon on Saturday. Oh yeah, mom, there is another one. <gasps> Three butterflies. I got it down it yeah, it's a little one. I didn't see it. Look at that. How am I gonna open this one? Oh, here we go. So this is super cute. And they are wired to these other sticks that I'm going to twist and you know, we're gonna make little squiggles with them because you know I don't like them sticking straight like this stuff. Okay, so I'm gonna come in. Will you do any lives with Damon? You know what? I don't crafty stuff now. I don't know, but I if he lets me, I'm gonna try to do a live from the warehouse. Especially because I want to show Nana. So I will try to I will try to do that. I'm sure I won't be doing any bleep bleep bleeping because that's not my role there. <laughs> but to see the bleep bleeps would be very cool. All right, so let me get on in here behind my bow. I am 18 miles south of Lafayette, Cajun country. Oh my goodness. Now Lafayette, is it, that is where the Bayou Boys are, right? So I'm gonna weave this stick. This is all stickage and all bendy all around. Okay, and I'm gonna shorten it by wrapping it around my finger. Separating all the little leaves and sticks and all that kind of stuff. Lisa lost it. Damon said on a live the other night he might have you make something on a live. <gasps> He's, when did he say that? <gasps> oh my God. When did he say that? <gasps> oh my gosh, that would be so fun. I probably pulled my pants. Anyway, stop. I can't think about it. Nana, you know I get nervous. Joanne, stop. <laughs> For God's sake, you do it every damn day. I know, but it's different when you have, like, he has thousands of people watching him. That's all right. All right. One person Look how tall this is. is. I got to cut some of this down. It's not even in the picture. Hold the phone, baby. Hold the phone. Okay. So we have this oopsie, beautiful butterfly on the top of the bow. Oh, I can't believe he said that. I didn't hear it. Saturday night. Saturday night? Ooh, that's awesome. Saturday don't night. Don't do that, Jojo. What? Don't I do what? Willie said don't do something. Don't do what? Bleep bleep? Oh, that's pretty. I had to cut I had to cut it. This thing is humongous, so I'm going to come down this way and add it on this side and then we'll reshape it in the right direction. Don't do what, Willie? Cut my butterflies? What? Too late. Here we go. Your pants. Oh! oh. <laughs> that will not be pretty. That would not be. That would not be nice. But everybody would laugh. Uh, no, they would not like that. Nana, we Listen. have to clear the room. <gasps> Who do you think? You, you know what? You're just rude. I heard him say it too. Oh, <gasps> you did? Oh my. Okay, so I'm loving this butterfly. <laughs> this is way too tall. So we're going to cut this and I'm going to come out over uh, here. Your mom is correct. Just think one person, the rest will follow. Just think, what? It doesn't just make it. There's one or five thousand. It, it it's it's it it's a it, lot, Mom. It's, no, Joanne. Yeah, because if you're trying to read <laughs> comments and stuff, they they go they go so fast. No, I can't read anything. And, and they'll read. Somebody else will read the comments. Oh Don't Lord read. Jesus, help us! I'm so excited because I get to see Jordan. Hopefully, he's gonna be. He's leaving tonight, I think, or tomorrow morning. And Megan and him will be there tomorrow in the afternoon ish. Because uh, I think they both arrive at like 10 or 11. So it's, they'll get to the warehouse like noonish, probably have lunch, and then be bleep bleeping by the afternoon. <gasps> New stuff's coming. Oh, gosh. Anywho. And. All right. So this little butterfly. It sounds like this little piggy. This little butterfly. Um, do I want to go? I think. I have two of these, so we're going to use them both. But I think what I'm going to do is come in here and let that fly up that way. So let's bend that like a upside down L, right? Give it a little, little ski lift right there. We don't like that. 
And that way when I go in here, I can just push it up and into that grapevine. Perfection. It's gonna sit right there. Let's get our leaves flipping out. These butterflies are beautiful. Now it's wired, so I am gonna wire it slightly closer to the branch because I don't want it to look like it's gonna fall off. You get a little stick right there. Okay, if you wanted to, you could glue Where did you it. Get the, somebody, Don is late. Where did you get the butterfly? This butterfly pick <clears throat> is a Regency, and it did come from Deco Exchange. It's super tall, has all kinds of sticks. Let me show you, because we're going to use the other one coming down. I'll just have to turn my butterflies the other way. <laughs> Willie says, Nana, you better keep JoJo's credit card. <gasps> New stuff coming in means trouble. They have it it's on file. She could take the credit card. It wouldn't matter. Is what is she doing? Too. Oh, Tammy's going too? <gasps> I did not know that. All right, so this is, so see it comes with these butterflies that are water resistant. They're like a canvas, but they have like a plastic um, overlay. Well, the plas this plastic comes off, but this is, um, and then there's another one up here. So all of this is wired to the very tippy top, every little stick. So it's fabulous. So we're going to take another stick and go this way and then just bend our butterflies the other way. And I have one purple butterfly. So that will be good because it will set things off. Because I am going to use that as well. All right. So I am going to. Tammy's going somewhere. I thought it was Deco. I thought, I'm not sure. She had an event this weekend. She ran, um. Was it her patriotic porch? Oh gosh, I can't remember. So this, these went up. These are going to come down. They're going to come out and down. Can you guys see? Out and down. She doesn't fly. No, she takes a train. She has flown, but she doesn't like it. I don't love it either, but I can do it. Okay, let's get this little... Thing over there now every little every branch here has a lot of these sticks I'm literally separating them and rolling them around my finger to the end because these little leaves are wired to the sticks so everything can get moved around you could actually unwire it if you wanted to and put it in another location like this see it comes right off then you can take this stick and roll it and then either wire Her it back on. Is virtual, isn't it? She was she had a virtual today. event. She had a virtual event over the weekend, I do believe. All right, so now this one, right, is going to go been in here. Driving to Deco the last few times, yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> she lives um, near Branson, Mom, Springfield, oh. Missouri. Wow, that's a haul. Yeah. Did you go to Branson, Mom? Nope. I thought you said you had gone. Nope, never been to Branson. Well, there you go. We I've been go. in the Caribbean. Yeah, I know that, but you, I thought you had gone back before. To the Caribbean. What, listen, just cool your jets over there. I've got to go to North Ooh, Carolina. You think you're just going to move on to a cruise ship? Maybe. Some people do that. They just book their cruises. Back to back. We had some 90-year-old lady dancing all, all by herself. She didn't want anybody dancing with her. She danced every night, all night long, all by herself. Well, good for her. Yep. Crack will do that to you. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> so will booze. Oh, gosh. Okay. This does take a little bit of time, guys, but it's worth the effort because it brings a lot of... <laughs> Cruise with the Juan Pablo. Yeah, she was on a cruise with Juan she Pablo. The butterfly bush. Uh, it came from Deco. It is a Regency. So if you look up Regency, hold on if I can find the tag, guys. Oh, criminy. I think I just threw it out. Hold on. Hold on, I'll find the stick. Oh, here it is. Here it is. It is called a Garden Blossom Butterfly Spray. It's 36 inches yellow. MTF. 242260 Celebrity. Yep. Yeah. Well, that's where we, we Yes, can... my mother went on celebrity. So it's oh, M Ma Shush. MTF 24 
226. Now, I know it's backwards, but in case, let's see if I can get that to go clear. Mm, I don't think I can. Oh. Sorry, I can't make it go clear. All right. So, we're going to keep on keeping on. Now, this one I think I'm going to swirl into the center. All right, get some of this greenery and this big butterfly. And I'm going to do like that. Do like, I'm just going to do like this. And I do like that. Give it a little dip de do. And we're going to go right up into that grapevine. Pull it out. Right. Let's bring it down a little bit. I like to have a little activity going on in there. Not a whole lot, but just a little something, something. Okay. So. Well, that, I'm excited. I didn't know Tammy was coming. I'm happy to see her. All right. One, two, three, four. I cannot live with four. And I have a purple, which is five, six, seven. Well, seven's a little much, but whatever. We're going to use it. We're going to do this. Because don't forget, I got a lot more purple to go on in here. And a lot more yellow. 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 I get that from Megan. <laughs> okay, we're going to open up this little baby butterfly. It's so cute. And this one's going to come way down. All right, so I'm going to leave this stick super straight. But I'm going to go in pretty deep in there. Oops, I'm stuck. Here we go. Okay. So you guys can see the difference in that yellow. It really has a tip of that orange, right? Now these, some of these are paper. So if you steam them or just separate them, you'll get bigger blooms. Just pull them apart and twist and they make a bigger bloom. Okay, so let's see. We're going to do that. So this is actually coming off. Let me show you the side view. Can you see how far that's coming off? I like that. Is there an event at that? No, it's a meeting. It's a meeting for some folks that are in a group. All right. So next thing I'm going to do is go in with this purple because it does have a little bit of yellow, which I might end up taking off because it's a little bit lemony for me. And it has... It has the greenery and the little berries that I love, but I'm not a huge fan of this yellow piece. So, because you can see it's lemony and that one's not. So we're gonna cut it off. Hi, sayonara. So sorry for your loss. Okay. Now these little um, daisies, I'm just gonna flip them so they're looking at me. And I'm gonna take this big old pick we're going to jam it up on in there. Now, I could have cut that, but no need. Now, I'm going to move over some of this fern and some of the purple and mix up that branch. Separate my berries. Okay. These guys, I'm just going to roll and get them out of the way for now like the curlers in your hair. We're just going to roll them up like curlers. I'm going to be messing with those right now. Come on. Let's go, Gladys. Get out of the way. Okay. You too. I'm flip you over there. Okay. Now, uh, I need another one of those for coming out that side. This one was also from Deco for... 4,000 IPU, 4,000 IPU, PU. And again, I'm going to cut the yellow piece off. Could you save it? Absolutely. Am I going to? No. All right. So I'm going to do the same thing I did with that. I'm going to flip my flowers towards me. I'm going to spread out all the granaries and the berries and make sure the good stuff is facing me. 
I love these little berry things. Can you see these? I love those. And it's going to give me a nice soft finish in here. I'm going to cut off half the stick and give it a bend to follow my grapevine. This was a pretty narrow oval grapevine, so I don't want it to stick way out. So let's give a big old glop of glue and lift all this pretty and get it up on in there. There we go. You do such gorgeous work. Oh, thank you. Who said that? Pam. Thank you, Vincent. Thank you, Pam. That's very sweet of you. I appreciate that. Okay, so I'm going to hold on to this butterfly because we'll probably end up using it. But let me clean off some of this. That little green piece of And... I've got some gorgeous, these are gorgeous. Now, I love an allium. This is a Regency allium. Nice shade of purple. It reminds me of like a denim purple, if that, if that is a thing, because it's soft, has like a little bit of white in the middle of it. And I love this filigree, these little teeny wispy pieces. Although... Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you, Margie and Donna. So this one's going to be kind of a big one. But you know I like it big. We still haven't added Alan in our yellow beer. What's that? Alan Wellen. Alan Wellen! How are you, friend? I miss you. Oh my God, those pictures you put up of the puppy. She's the sweetest. All I can think about is my little ladybug every time I see her. She has a beautiful white boxer, Mom. Just like nice a little summer. sweet ladybug. So I'm going to put some allium in there. It's it's soft like this particular one. Nobody pay attention to that. I just sort of threw it to get it out of the way. Let's see if we can roll her up. And we're going to put those little allium balls everywhere and the little tufts of these. We're going to spread those out. Cause they're super pretty and they have a little bit of white it's almost like they have angel hair on them but it's the plastic from the mold so you just pull that off and give a little dipsy do and i miss you bella's such a sweet baby i know i can't i need to come in over there and because i just need to kiss her i think we're going to be besties i know we are a she's a boxer a and b she's a dog and her name is Bella, and dogs just love me anyway. They just do. Every one of them. Isn't that truth, Mom, right? Yeah. It's true. I'm like a Dr. Doolittle. Oops. I got stuck in my branch. Hold on. Hello, little girl. Some allium up in there. You're a sweet baby, too. Yeah. Your mother forgets. I Your don't forget. Forgets. I don't forget about my street dog. She's a good girl. She gets tired of me kissing her face. Who? Oh, my gosh. Does she sneeze when you do it? Does she go, hush, hush? That's what Luciano does to me all the time. You I'm adding some of the little the white. Here. Mom, the dog ate prime rib tonight. It's not like I ever forget about her. That's that. Yes, you heard me right. Gia got prime rib. Luciano got chicken and rice and carrots. Yeah, she's my girl. Oh, Nana. She's my girl. She loves me. Yeah. She just wants to sit on Nana's lap. You know why? Because Nana eats all day and drops it all down her chest, so she just picks it up for her. It's okay. You know it's true, Ma. She kisses back. Oh, I know they do. Luciano's a big licker, too. He just is a love bug. I'm going to go up in here to bring a few of the balls. My sweet friend Jojo, you did it again. It's absolutely gorgeous. Who said that? Oh, thank you, Maria. Some more balls. Got to have the balls. Oops. Don't she forget your hair? No, I do not. Don't tell people that, Elaine. I don't forget about Gia ever. She sits on my lap all night long and sleeps on my neck. I don't forget about her. She doesn't let me breathe. She's fresh. I'm not fresh to her. 
So down here we're going to add some allium balls. Right up in here. Coming out this way. Right up behind right here. Okay. And then separate these little pieces. These little pieces get really, really tangled, so just take your time and separate them because it's worth it. The vibes they give and the white that it's sort of like a not a dusty miller, but it has like a white like a dusty miller is more flocked. This is not flocked, it's like a painted um white. Lots in here and our other ones are gonna come down here. Okay. What's that? Well, we hope that we make you happy because, you know, we want you to come here and have a good time. That's for sure. All right. The Nana likes to make fun of me. All right, so let's go in with some beautiful ranunculus. Now, guys, I haven't even got to our big flowers. So I'm only going to use two of these, I think. Yes, I said two. I'm not sure I can handle it, so I might have to do three. Because um, the purple on this is going to be really outstanding with that yellow. I think I'm going to go right in there with one of them. Let's do that. Put a little bit of glue on that leaf. So I don't like the way it was sitting. All right, and this one too. And I'm going to dip it and stick it. Right up in there. I like it with this yellow orange butterfly. What's the matter, Roachy boy? What's the matter? He's like breathing like fire. Hi, baby. You okay? He's just out of breath, Ma. He's okay. Hi, handsome. All right, so we got one here, and we're going to um, triangulate these out. So we're going to definitely go up under here. I'm going to put it in and then angle it towards me. Well, let's see how it works out. I'm going to get through that eucalyptus. Okay, it's going to be fine. And it has that yellow orange up on the inside of it. And we're going to do this one over here like that. And then don't worry, we'll go back and fluff our bows for the 90th time. Because you know I can't, I can't not touch my bows. And then we'll un uncurl all the things that we did. See, it has the um, the same color yellow in there. I know. And she doesn't usually braid like that, huh? Mom, give them a minute, please. All right. Don't be making me nervous. It's okay. Your brother's okay. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. All right. So, over here, right up in there. Oh, stuck it out. Burnt myself. Well, it's never a wreath unless I burn myself, right? Okay. <clears throat> okay. So we have a triangulation of those really, really dark. Oh, guys, I didn't know that you couldn't see. Is that better? I don't know. I can't see anything. It just stops. It's, I can only read comments. Hold on. That might be better. Sorry, guys. Is that better? I don't know if that's the greatest view, but so big one here, here and here. Okay. We've got our butterflies hanging out. We're going to curl those curls down in a bit. First, next thing we're going to do is get our yellow. Now I have two options and I think I'm actually going to go, I was going to do the ranunculus. Who's here? 
Oh, hi, Kimmy. Oh. I could see you fine. Everybody can see. All right, so this, beautiful. And I'm going to um, pull this apart. I like the greenery. Um, I like the white. And definitely love those poppies. It also has, you can see these little dark poppy pieces. They're lovely as well. <clears throat> we may not even get to the ranunculus. I got so much up in here. It seems like a lot. <gasps> Elaine! Seems like a lot. Who do you think you are talking to? We need to have the yellow. All right. These Those yellow poppies out. are amazing. Look how nice they stick Those out. yellow poppies are gorgeous. Can you see them? Let's see if I can get you up a little taller. This is a very tall wreath. It's like 29, 30 inches. Let me fix that. <coughs> Elaine, get something to suck on. You need something? No, I'm good. All right, so this one I'm going to put a big L into it and try to get it way up in there. There we go. Because I want to get some of those orange pieces. And I love this greenery. This greenery right here coordinates with this one as well. They have that little dust of white on them, which she is said, perfect. Kimmy said, just got home from spending a couple of days with Bristol. She helped <gasps> me with flower arrangement when oh, I was there. Oh, Bristol, how sweet. I'm going to put a little bit of white up in here. The white will help my purple and yellow all stand out. Oops. We lost the berries. We can't lose the leaves. Okay, in here. We need yellow here. I really, really love this yellow. That butterfly has to come down. We need another up here. These pieces is or sevens. Seven. Your wreath is stunning. Thank you guys so much. I know that I didn't, I messed my uh, bow up a little bit, but we'll get that, we'll get that fluffed out appropriately as soon as I unfurl yeah, all the curls. Beautiful wreath design. This is absolutely my favorite right here. Oh, thank you so much. This one is a wild, wild flower, you know, that's my attempt at doing it sort of wild and whimsical and. Is it posted? It is available. It is in the shop. It is under the ad. This one's going to go right in here. It looks like the ad right under the featured items. So that one's going to go in here, stick out the side with that little piece of yellow and white. Now, I'm going to try to bend that forward a little bit. There we go. This yellow is just really, really pretty. here as well have a wonderful trip my sweet and enjoy your thank you i will i will i'm gonna forget all about the office for a couple of days i know it will be havoc when i get back but that's when i get back and i am really really prepared so i've gotten myself into a good rhythm at the office so i i am prepared i did a ton of work last week to get me ready to be away like all the stuff for commencement and all that kind of stuff is all in really really good shape i have pinning ceremonies a grad ceremony an undergraduate ceremony and so you know um the president of Sinn Féin is coming to the, the university. I've talked about that before. And that is a gigantic party for about Can we see three. Can stand? Yes, I will show it to you as soon as I get this up. 
So that party is about 300 people. The night before, I have to do graduation for 1,000 students and 5,000 guests. And then after they leave, the same day we do um, the grad ceremony that night. So it's a lot in a little bit amount of time. So in here, I'm adding all of these little wispy bits to fill in. And greenery, a little more white right here, I think. Nope, right there. Right in there. All right, let's get rid of that. Let's get our butterfly over here. Now, this butterfly is wired, so you can untwist it. Let me see, I'm a little bit stuck. And lengthen it or shorten it by that wire. I know I'm in the way, sorry guys. So I'm gonna get that going in there with this little leaf, <clears throat> some florals sticking out and branches. So now I'm gonna start to uncurl the ribbons that I had tucked for some pretty ends. See where we end up here. Did he ring the bell? I don't know. I didn't hear it though. All right. Hi, Loach. He might be looking for a drink. That's gonna go this way, and this needs to pop out a little bit. So we've got these. Let's see. Let's not curl that one. My big boy. Beautiful tails, right? All around, and I have one, just one, but it's the right color purple, so I am going to use it. I just can't decide where. Probably where right there. Where's the purple peony? This is a peony. That's a peony. I'll show you when where I take it off the reef. What's that? Carol Ann just got here. Where are you going? I am going to see Damon and Parker. I'm going to take the stick off of this and I'm going to glue it right to this little ribbon right here. For a CMC meeting, which is one of the coaching groups um, with Deco Exchange. I'm very, very excited. It's a last minute. I decided to go at the last minute. Because my other trip to Louisiana fell through. Um, all right. Now, I just want to make sure that I don't need any yellow. Says, oh, I didn't see the dark purple. It doesn't show in camera. I know. It doesn't. But let me give you a close-up. Let's see. I might need a few more pops of yellow. But let's see. So there's that dark peony. You can see them right on the inside. What do we think? Nice and whimsy at the top. I think I might need a little bit of yellow here. And probably down here. Get that butterfly down a little further. Extend the length. And pull out a few of the yellow ranunculus. So pretty. Just wish I liked butterflies. Who's that? Tammy. You're not a butterfly person? Some people are afraid Willie of them. Says, wow, wow, wow. <laughs> Thank you, Willie. So I'm taking my ranunculus and I'm separating. See, when you see this, you want to separate them a little bit. And it makes your bloom a lot bigger. And it it um they don't it just doesn't look like it was stuck together and then left there. Here we go. 
Needed that. Totally needed that. See how it changed it a little bit? I'm going to do a couple more. And probably right in here behind this peony, it will help that peony show up. Get this over here if you guys can see a little bit closer. Oops, I missed the grapevine. Looking at Gia's one ear up, she's so cute. Oh, yeah. She's always got one ear that's a little bit crinkled. So a little bit of yellow back there helps to highlight this because they are so, they almost, you know, they're dark like grape soda purple. That makes any sense. Okay. Vincent says you never cease to amaze with all the beautiful colors. Absolutely stunning. Thank you, Vincent. That's really kind of you. Sometimes I just get bored with my colors. I got to try something new. So we triangulated out this one, this one, and I'm going to bring another one down in here to sort of lighten it a little bit. Bring it in there. It's got a little bit of uh, like Queen Anne's lace attached. I love these purples, the dark and the soft, and they're just the right hue. Because sometimes purples can be a redder purple or a bluer purple. So it can be a struggle when you're trying to match purple. But these happen to work out just fine. What do you think, Ma? How many butterflies? I One, can't, I can't really see two, my thing three, four, five. <gasps> oh, I have six. Let's do a seven. I have one. We're going to use it. We're going to use it. Let's do this. Let's break it down and twist them up. Might as well use it, right? It's on the table. What the heck? A little couple of things going on here. So if you see me Wednesday, <coughs> excuse me, I think I just inhaled up. I don't know what that was. Um, I will so likely much watching you beautiful design. Thank you so much. Jenny. Thank you, Jenny. Just mess with your colors, right? Try something a little non-traditional. If you have struggle with your colors, you can always get a color wheel. Um, I took color theory in college. So if you like taking college courses, that's always a good college course to take to understanding colors and what they mean and how they work and warm and cool and all of that kind of stuff was was a really good course. I didn't take it for wreath making, but I was a art and music student when I first went to college. And um, I'm going to put a butterfly here and take this off of here. The dark purple with the light purple and the yellow give it so much dimension. Then the wispiness takes over the top. Yeah. Sometimes I get lucky, guys. You just got to try it. Just got to try it, right? This could have been a hot mess express. In some people's eyes, it will be a hot mess express. In others, it will find it beautiful and whimsical, right? I do love a lot of stickage. I love that rustic look about it. Um, these are nice because you can bend the wings up or down, you know, so if you wanted it to look like it had just landed like that, you could do that. So I'm going to take this wire and I think I'm going to wrap it around. Hi, like Jojo. Annette says, Jojo, I don't know who designs better, you or Jordan, always beautiful. Oh, thank you so much. That's a lovely comparison because I love Jordan's work. Love it. All right, so now I'm happy. I've got seven butterflies and not six because, you know, I struggle with the odds and evens. I love, I'm happy, happy, happy. We've got our yellow mixed. 
All right, so let's take that. I'll show you my board. First, let me show you this. I'll take pictures of it so you guys can see it. It is an oval grapevine. It's about 30 inches long now. And 22 inches wide. Okay, so um, this it is, it has a chain, it comes with the handle and you just pick it up and it goes like that and then you sit it down and having that hole there allows you to go through the back if you needed to. So it's quite lovely, it's not heavy, it comes with this, don't Jordan pay attention who? to that. Jordan. Jordan who? Jordan Matthews with designs by Jordan. Whoops, there we go. And this brocade one, this braided crocheted, I'll just love that little piece right there. It's a nice soft lavender purple. So that is it guys. Thanks for hanging with me. I appreciate it. I'll get some pictures of her and um, you know, Try different color combos. Just try it. You never know what you're going to come up with. I really like this one, and I never used to be a purple girl, and now I'm all about it. That's it. Have a great night. Be kind to one another. Love you all, and I'll see you hopefully on the lives from Louisiana. Bye, guys.